Hi friends and welcome back to this channel. My name is Tindai and thank you so much for tuning in today into this morning's free walk and devotions. It is my prayer that you might find this message encouraging, may it bless you as you carry on and soldier on in your own personal time and devotions today. Amen. Now, having said that, I'm just going to do something different with you all this morning. I'm going to share some of my favorite scriptures that minister to me, that speak to me in times where I feel low, in times where I feel anxious or worried. They just help me to remind me of my position in the body of Christ, right? They help me to stay focused and to remain rooted in the word of God. Amen. Now, the first scripture goes as follows. I knew you before I formed you in your mother's womb. Before you were born, I set you apart and I appointed you as my prophet to the nations. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. Now you are no longer a slave, but God's own child. And since you're his child, God has made you his heir. And I'm convinced that nothing can separate us from God's love. Neither death, nor life, neither angels, nor demons, neither our fears for today, nor our worries for tomorrow, nor even the powers of hell can separate us from God's love. No power in the sky above or in the earth below Indeed, nothing in all creation will ever be able to separate us from the love of God that is revealed in Christ Jesus our Lord. Amen. I will go before thee and make the crooked places straight. I will break in pieces the gates of brass and cut in sunder the bars of iron. Do not be afraid or discouraged. For the Lord will personally go ahead of you, he will be with you, he will neither fail you nor abandon you. Amen. Right, now thank you so much for tuning in today, guys. I really hope and pray that you will allow the Holy Spirit to minister to you as I've already said. I hope you let him guide you into taking the word of God set in your heart. I know there's so many things happening in the world where the majority of us are either confused, we are stuck in worry and anxious, but I want to remind you today that the Word of God is alive, the Holy Spirit is here to minister to us, and that God will never leave us nor forsake us, and He will be with us till the edge of time, right? That God, through His love and His mercy that we experience through Christ Jesus, has already has a set plan for us, and that plan will never fail and the words that is spoken they will come to pass amen all right guys this is what was set in my heart today and as i already said i hope it will minister to you today till then i'll see you next week take care god bless and goodbye